Hi everyone, it's Rosie from Rosie's Fab Finds. How is everybody today? I hope you're doing great. <laughs> today I have an exciting Dollar Tree haul. I found some new goodies as well as some a few little repeat items. So um, without further ado, I'm just going to get started. Now the first things I have here are these beautiful garden flags. Yes, I found some new ones. Um, they're new to me, but this one is so pretty. I mean, they're not the best quality. I mean, you, you're going to, you know, want to secure these. But if you're going to put it outside, make sure that it's not anywhere that, you know, it can blow away or you can secure it, you know, maybe with tape or something because they will blow away. <laughs> but um, I love these. I have one in my in my back patio there that it's it's been up year round. So uh, look at how pretty this one is. It has like a little bird bath and it says um, bloom and grow and it has a lot of beautiful flowers on there in the background and with little birds in there. I mean so so cute. I love this one. I can't wait to use this in the backyard. So there's that. Then the second one I picked up, I'm going to open it up to show you guys. This is the picture right here. It says Home Sweet Home. And this one has a bunch of beautiful flowers. Look at this. With the bees and the beautiful flowers. And it says Home Sweet Home. So pretty. I really, really like this one. So look at all the pretty, beautiful flowers, bumblebees, just gorgeous. I cannot wait for spring. I'm done with the snow. If you know, you know, here in upstate New York, we're gearing up for another storm. So here we go. <laughs> but anyway, we're trying to keep a positive attitude. And speaking of that, look at this little guy. He's been around since last year. Um, I just wanted another one. So I picked one up in the purple. So cute. Like Sweet Sadie J says, purple. <laughs> and he is so cute. It's part of the Fuzzy Friends brand. And look at his pretty little ears coming out of his little gnome hat. Look at him. So fluffy. He so cute. Love him. <laughs> All right. So let's see. Moving on with some other cute items. This is one that you can color. It is from Star Wars and Mandalorian and this is Grogu or Baby Yoda and you can paint him. Yeah, he's like a plastic and it comes on the bottom. I don't know if you see there, there's markers on the bottom or you can use your own paints. You don't have to use the, um, the markers on there and you can paint it any way you want. So that's a great activity for kids on a rainy day or whoever that wants to do that. And I think he's so precious. So there you go. Baby Yoda. Then I also got, pardon my reach, down here somewhere. Oh, here she is. Oh, no, that's not it. <laughs> All right. Here she is. I got Minnie. <laughs> Yeah, this is Minnie. She's so cute. And she's got like a little heart on the back. And with flowers and everything. So that's her cute little face. And you can paint it. And there's the markers underneath here too. You can use your own paint or whatever you... Or your own markers, whatever you want to do. And I thought she was super cute. So yes, those are new to me at the DT. Yes. Then, let's see. Hmm. All right. We're going to move to the outdoors. Yeah, we're going to move to the outdoors. Look at these beauties. Now, I remember last year I couldn't get a hold of them. So this year I said, I if I, they come out, I'm going to grab them when I see them. So here's this one. They look like beautiful little lanterns. Make sure it has the little yellow tab to pull. And it has the stake on the bottom so that you turn it around and insert it in the ground. And it has the solar on the top. 
the little panel. So just make sure it has those two things, the, the little tab and the stake on the bottom so you can use it. So I actually picked up two of those. Beautiful. Then let's see. Hmm. Oh, for the home, look at this four pack. Yeah, I'm not talking only one nightlight. We're talking four pack name brand Sunbeam nightlights. Yes, four automatic four pack LED nightlights. Yes. So, yeah. Let's see here. Yeah, four of them. They have the LED light already in them. So, there you go. You can put them in each bathroom, bedrooms, kids' bedrooms, whatever you want to do. But you get four instead of one for $1.25. So, I thought that was a great deal. And I said, you know, I'm going to put them in my bathrooms in that. So, have them on hand in emergencies, whatever. Keep the extras. So, there you go. Four pack. Great deal. Then along in the home stuff, I did pick up one of these. Now, this is like the Swiffer kind of thing. And it, these are the ones, the home, the essentials one that have the, um, the sticks, you know, the mop sticks or whatever you want to call them that you buy separately. But I already have one. So I'm going to use this, put, put it, um, like secure it in here. And I saw this on TikTok where this will, any microfiber um, towel like this from the Dollar Tree or wherever you want to get it, but I got mine at the DT. You could put this around, you're going to tie it around, and you can put the, the big stick on it, and you can reach the high places like a fan or um, in your uh, shower where you can't reach to clean it. Um, you can use this and with the microfiber towel and put it around it instead of buying you know swiffers each time you can buy these and swap them out wash them and put it back on again so you're not wasting a lot of um stuff and you're not using a lot of you know maybe like detergents and like cleaners and that so i thought these two items that i saw on tiktok being used were a great idea so i went ahead and got it as soon as i remembered it because if not you know we're getting up there in years i'll forget <laughs> so anywho let's see what else we got oh yes i got this this is new to me it might have been out for a little while but i thought this was super cute and it is in the baby aisle where the baby stuff is and it is a little like measuring cup or whatever to um, rinse out baby's hair when you're washing it but it doesn't have to be for a baby. It can be used for your fur babies, if, you know, puppies. That's what I'm using mine, excuse me for, um, to make sure that her little, you know, body is rinsed off and sometimes she's, you know, doesn't like it. So I gotta hurry up and, <laughs> and this is plastic, won't hurt her, you know, if, if she automatically, you know, boops up and wants to run away. <laughs> this is um, silicone here, the little spout and it's all plastic so i thought this was really really cute and a good deal especially if you have little ones pets you name it you can use it for that okay so great deal then i needed one of these a strainer and i needed the thin you know the fine one so that i can rinse um rice or pasta whatever you're going to use it for i i like to rinse my rice in it to make um spanish rice so i decided to get another one of these because i don't know i think my other one had feet and it just walked away or somebody threw it out i don't know <laughs> but here we go and these for a dollar 25 again in the cooking essentials aisle this is a great deal so my rice rinser <laughs> and then in another kitchen item i found these super value eight sponges scouring sponges i needed sponges or who doesn't need sponges for the kitchen and how many times am i going to say sponges so anyway here's eight of them for a buck 25 can't beat them um 
probably not the best, you know, you use them a little bit and then you toss them and then you use another one. So that's why you get eight. <laughs> so not bad. And then we got this. This was new to me. Um, these are, well, I think they've had them before, but I didn't see this color. The latex grip gloves for gardening or housework, whatever you want. Um, they're not waterproof really, but they do have like a rubber rubber grips on them. So, you know, if you have any labor intensive stuff to use it for, there you go. And this is in the ladies latex grip gloves. One size fits most. So there you go. Self-explanatory, they're gloves. No big deal. <laughs> Um, and then last but not least, I got these. These were in the crafter square. And at first I thought they were, um, coasters. I guess you can use them as coasters, but look at this. I just got to open them up to see how cute these are. They're, um, farmhouse sign. And they did have like one that had like a little barn in the shape of a little barn. Um, and they come, let's see, three to a pack. But I thought they were so cute. They are like pressed kind of cardboard. And this one says, filled with joy. And it has a little mason jar with the little flowers. And it's just plain on the back. But I mean, you don't have to use it for, you know, a little sign or whatever. You can make whatever you want. You can put this on a wreath. You can put it on a, a sign, whatever you want. You could use it as a coaster probably if you put like maybe like a plastic like little um covering over it maybe like you know that adhesive kind of plastic over it you can use it as a coaster why not so they did come three to a pack and i thought these were adorable even if you send them and you know in mail whatever make someone's day and they're just a little mason jar with flowers so that is it my friends for this video i hope you enjoyed it um yeah <laughs> it's a few things so um let's lift each other up not put each other down i'll see you in my next one and remember if you're gonna enter my giveaway for the craft a few crafting items uh it's just gonna be a mystery box of surprises for my 500 plus giveaway um enter with using hashtag spring you have to be 18 and over um live in the united states and also be subscribed to my channel it's only fair so anyway guys hope to see you in my next one bye bye